Well, welcome back to our phonics portion of the day. And of course, today we're going to go over our sight words for the week. We're also going to go over our nonsense words or make-believe words. We'll go over our letters and sounds. We're going to blend and segment phonemes. We are going to listen for words that we hear the ah sound either in the middle or in the beginning of words. We'll also read a story today that is a poem that has been turned into a book, but also looking for details in the story. Okay. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started with our letters and sounds. And remember friends, bing, bang, boom, lickety split on this. Okay, we have 40 words or more that we need to do in one minute. All right, so here we go. Let's do sound first. B. Ah. Mm. Ah. Uh. G. Uh oh. That one we already said. Uh. So this one should be. N. Mm. G. E. Eh. I. K. K. Very, very good. Good job, friends. All right. Let's go ahead and do. Let's name our letters. So here we go. A N G E I C Q K S X V R D J Y U W L P T Z B F H O M. Mm, very, very good. That was excellent, my friends. All right, let's go ahead and do our sight words. Okay, here we go. Good. Sad. Then was. Remember that ah sound there sounds like uh was. All give soon for could new your Ooh. play say them here eight Make, superstar E, go, they, be, are, my, bandit Y, you, me, to, I, see, I see, like, a, into, of, come, is, on, this, with, how, where, from, find, and, will, the, came, many, so, now, that, what, we, and, but. Ooh, very, very good. All right, friends. So we had five new ones, but there are Three more that I am adding. Make sure that your parents look at the checklist for the additional three that we're going to be working on, okay? All right, let's go ahead and do our nonsense words. Remember, friends, with nonsense words, we are now quietly sounding it out in our brain and just reading the word, okay? So, sub. Taz, ret, sub, 
jock, tar, hem, jiff, ick, back, keb, maz, vim, dig, taff, bob, ix, beth, peb, beck, et, jack, light, ab, waz, lux, wub. Very, very good. Good job, friends. All right, so let's go ahead. I'm going to, I want you to listen to these sounds. I want you to blend it and tell me the word. Okay, so here we go. B, E, D. What is the word? Bed. Great job. All right, let's go to the next one. W, E, G. What is my word? Wig. Great job. All right. Op. What is my word? Mm hmm. Great job. Er, uh, g. What is my word? Mm hmm. Rug. Excellent. N, app. What is my word? Mm hmm. Nap. Very good. Now, you say all the sounds in tug. What are the sounds in tug? Mm hmm. T -ug. Good job. What are the sounds in mud? Mm hmm. Mm -ud. What are the sounds in box? Mm hmm. B ox. What are the sounds in sad? Mm hmm. Act. What are the sounds in net? Uh huh. N et. What are the sounds in sit? Mm hmm. S it. Great job, friends. What are the sounds in bed? Mm hmm. B ed. Great listening ears, my friends. All right. So for Ollie, the octopus. I am going to say, I want you to listen to some of my words, okay? And then you're going to tell me what sound you hear at the beginning, okay? So listen to this one. Odd, odd. What sound do you hear at the beginning of odd? Mm-hmm, ah, good job. Ox, ox. What sound do you hear at the beginning of ox? Mm-hmm. Ah. Uh, object. Object. What sound do you hear at the beginning of object? Mm-hmm. Ah. Uh, what sound do you hear at the beginning of ant? Ant. Mm-hmm. Ah. Uh, great job. What sound do you hear at the beginning of ostrich? Ostrich. Very good. Ah. Uh, and what sound do you hear at the beginning of apple? Apple. Very good. Ah. All right, friends. So now I'm going to say some words. If you hear the ah uh sound at the beginning, I want you to say beginning, beginning, beginning. If you hear the ah uh sound in the middle, I want you to say middle, middle, middle. Got it? All right. So here we go. All right, so here's our first word, on, on, beginning, 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 great job, ox, ox, beginning, 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 great job, pot, pot, middle, 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 great job, my friends, shop, shop, middle, 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 excellent. Otter, otter, beginning, beginning, beginning. Lot, lot, middle, middle, middle. Excellent listening, friends. Great job. All right, so now let's go ahead and help Ollie here. We need to figure out where we hear the sound of 
ah. Okay, so here we go. All right, we also have to figure out which word matches our picture. All right, so here is a cat or a cot. Mm-hmm, cot. That one has the ah uh sound in the middle. Let's see which other object Ollie can fish for that has the ah uh sound in the middle. Top or tap? Top or tap? Mm-hmm, top. Okay, how about here? Mat, mop. Mat, mop. Which one has the ah? Uh? Mm-hmm, mop. Great job. Pig, pot. Pig, pot. Correct again. Pot has the Ah, sound in the middle. Okay. Dip, dot. Dip, dot. Mm hmm. Dot. Great job. And finally, we have cob, can. Cob, can. Which one has the ah sound in the middle? Mm hmm. Cob. This is a corn cob. Great job, friends. All right, as I mentioned a bit ago, we are going to read a story today that is a poem that was turned into a story. Okay, and we're also going to be looking for details of things that we notice in our story. All right, so here we go. This is Zin, 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 a violin. It is written by Lloyd Moss, and it's illustrated by Marjorie Price Smith. All right, so here we go. And this here, friends, is my title page. Zin, 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 a violin by Lloyd Moss, illustrated by Marjorie Price Smith. Oh, and here's our table of contents. Remember, our table of contents tells us that there is one story on page two, and there is a second story with poems on page 30. So here we go. With mournful moan and silken tone, itself alone comes one trombone. Gliding, sliding, high notes go low. One trombone is playing so low. So here's a trombone. And when it says it's playing so low, that means it is on its own. There is only one instrument that is playing. So this is a trombone. Next, a trumpet comes along and sings and stings its swinging song. It joins trombone, no more alone, and one and two, and two oh, they're a duo. So when it says duo, that means there are two. So now we not only have the trombone, but we now have the trumpet as well. And look here. Do you notice how the cats are? They're enjoying the music of the duo. Okay. Ooh, this here, look at this. Fine French horn, its valves all oiled, bright and brassy loops all coiled, golden yellow joins its fellows. Two, now three, oh, what a trio. So now there is a trio. That means there are, count with me, one, two, three instruments playing. The first one was a, mm -hmm, a trombone, followed by a trumpet, and now a French horn. And look here, the cats really seem to be enjoying themselves. Yeah. It says golden yellow. That means that's the color of the French horn. 
Uh-oh, did you guys notice that mouth coming out of the horn? <laughs> there we go. Now, a mellow friend, the cello, neck extended, bows a hello, and pin set upon the floor. Here's that end pin right here. It makes up a quartet. That's four. So now we have a quartet, which means there are four. We have trombone, trumpet, French horn, and the cello. There's the mouse. See him? That's a kitty cat. So now we have four musicians. And soaring high and moving in with zin, 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 a violin. Stroking strings that come alive. Now quintet. Let's count them five. So let's count them, friends. One, two, three, four, five. So now we have a quintet. Beautiful. Flute that sends our soul a shiver. Flute that slender, sl slip, silver sliver, a place among the set of picks to make a young sextet. That's six. So now we have six tet in the group. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. Six with the flute. So let's go back. The first one was trombone. What was the second one? Do you remember? Ah, very good. The trumpet. Followed by mm -hmm, the French horn, the cello, the violin. Yeah, good memory, friends. That is great. All right, let's see. Their, their band is growing. With stilly keys that softly click, its breezy notes so darkly slick, a sleek black woody clarinet is number seven, now septet. So now they are considered a septet because there are seven. And look at them, friends. They are really enjoying playing their instruments. Uh-oh, and look here, the cat seems to have gotten the mouse's tail. <laughs> Gleeful, bleating, sobbing, pleading, through its throbbing, double reading. Oboe, please don't hesitate. Come make it an octet. That's eight. So now she is playing an oboe. And you see here the oboe? and the clarinet, they are in the wood family. Mm -hmm. So let's count and double check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And we know that the trombone, the trumpet, and the French horn are all in the brass company or in the brass family and the violin and the cello are in the string family. Wow. Uh-oh, there's a dog there now. That lazy clown, the big bassoon. He plays low down. We're laughing soon. Here, grumpy, get your place in line and give us a no nap. That's nine. Oh. So now there are nine. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And look at them. They are being super silly. Look here. Looks like he's swallowing his trombone. Look. She's holding the cello above her head. Oh, look at him. He's wearing his French horn as a hat. She's holding her flute above her. her head. Oh, look here. Look at the violin. 
And the oboe, she's like saying, woohoo, <gasps> look here, he's got his clarinet on his nose. And it appears that trumpet and the bassoon are the ones continuing to play. They're being silly. The harp descends with angel wings. Here's the harp. A heavens blend through magic strings. And when it joins the others, then behold a chamber group of ten. So now there are ten. Look here, friends. There's a string. Looks like it's holding her up. And here's another string holding up her harp as she plays high above in the air. And there's all the rest of her friends down on the bottom. See that? It's pretty awesome. The orchestra comes in the hall. There on the stage, we see them all. The cello, the harp, here's the harp, and clarinet, the trumpet, whom we've also met, the oboe, the flute, where's the flute? Oh, here's the flute, and big bassoon, trombone, French horn, and violin, all poised and ready, now begin. So let's count and see how many there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The orchestra is now ready. It is not a band, it is an orchestra. And there's the conductor. The strings all soar, the reeds implore, the brasses roar with notes galore. It's music that we all adore. It's what we go to concerts for. And look here, friends. The animals have all made friends with one another. They're really enjoying the, here is the Woods family. Then we have the string family, which is the cello, violin, and the harp. And then we have the brass family, which is the trombone, trumpet, and the French horn. What a nice group. The minutes fly, the music ends, and so goodbye to our new friends. But when they bowed and left the floor, if we clap loud and shout, encore, they may come back and play once more. So if you go to a concert and you say, encore, encore, the orchestra may come back and play one more song. And back here is all of the audience members clapping and woohoo, yay, yay. And that would give us great delight before we say a late good night. And the concert is over, and there's the custodian sweeping up the stage. That was a really nice story, friends. I hope you enjoyed it. Alrighty, I will see you guys in just a little bit. All right, bye, friends.